Antonio Stradivari was born around 1644 in Cremona, Duchy of Milan, present-day Italy. Synonymous with craftsmanship, excellence, and virtuosity in the world of stringed instruments, the Latinized names Stradivarius and the informal Strad are often used to refer to his creations. Little is known about his early life, but it's believed that he apprenticed under renowned violin maker Nicola Amati, whose workshop served as the breeding ground for some of the finest violin makers of the time. Under Amati's tutelage, Stradivari honed his skills and developed a deep understanding of the art of instrument making. After Amati's death in 1684, Stradivari's modest reputation began to rise slowly as he started making instruments with larger dimensions, showcasing a notable change in his style. He introduced larger violins, known as long strads, and switched to a darker varnish. Around 1700, he reverted to a slightly shorter model, marking the beginning of his golden period, which lasted until 1725. Instruments from this era are highly prized for their superior quality and command premium prices among collectors. Out of the 1,100 instruments crafted by Stradivari, only 650 have survived, with around 500 of them being violins. His violins, violas, and cellos are celebrated for their unparalleled tonal quality, exquisite beauty, and exceptional playability. The Stradivarius violin is highly sought after by both musicians and collectors, making it a symbol of excellence in the world of stringed instruments. The secret behind Stradivari's acoustically perfect violins, once thought to lie solely in their varnish, is now recognized to be influenced by factors such as wood plate thickness, the condition of the wood's pores, and the type of varnish, all meticulously balanced within his designs. Some of the famous Stradivarius violins, prized for their exceptional quality and historical significance, and sold for millions of dollars at auction, include the Molitor Stradivarius, Lady Blunt, the Hammer Stradivarius, the Solomon X Lambert Stradivarius, and Lady Tennant. Antonio Stradivari passed away in 1737 in Cremona at the age of 93. His instruments have been prized by the greatest virtuosos, including Niccolo Paganini, and remain in high demand, commanding high prices at auction and inspiring generations of musicians to strive for excellence. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons and see you in the next video.